Okay, we're good. We're good to go. Okay. Hi guys, so today I'm gonna show you guys what I got from Thailand. I've been wanting to do this haul for a while because I kept all of the clothes that I bought. Yeah, let's do it! I got a lot of stuff and I'm really excited about it and I don't normally do hauls but I just want to show it to you guys because I think it's pretty great. I think I got a good deal. Honestly, I think I got a good deal. I have a pair of shoes but don't mind, they're going to get them. Okay. I'm gonna go and get my shoes. Hold on. It's... It's like just a, a pair of black sandals, it has like a hook. Whoa! I don't know how to do hauls, man, but I'm just gonna show you, okay? I really like them. Really, really comfortable. And this was only like 120 baht. It's less than 5 sing dollars, like 450. This is a really great find. I got them off the street near Central World. Mm. Uh, moving on to bags, because I have a lot of clothes and that should be kept for last. This. Like, it's pretty freaking big lah. It's, it's like just a normal backpack. It reminds me of the Mensa Gravel one, except it's not matte, it's kind of, it's kind of glossy. You can fit A4, and I was like, oh, this is great for uni. And that's like a trend, okay? If you see all the stuff here, right, it's like all for uni. It's just like comfort clothing. Anyway, it has two compartments. Um, it has a zipper pocket, it has like, the opening is kind of small right? So I was like asking the lady if it could fit and she practically stuffed a magazine like into it quite violently to show me that it could fit. So I was like, ah oh, okay. It's just a nice bag right? It's black, it doesn't even have like hardware on it. Oh it has gold hardware but like, you can't tell. It was 300 baht which is... I'm so bad at math guys. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Um, 250 baht is 10 dollars. So 300 baht is 12 dollars. This is the next bag. This was 2 dollars. I mean, it's kind of cheapy on the inside, lah, but no one looks at the lining unless you're like, let me look at your lining. Yeah, anyway, it comes with a long strap which I took out. It's quite handy, it's quite small, it can fit like just an iPhone, a wallet, uh, some change. Yeah, I, I don't know, it was $2, I didn't really think too much about it. Okay, now we're gonna move on to clothes. I kind of feel like I'm rushing a little bit, but I'm actually, I'm not. It's just, I'm, I'm trying to chase the sun and I, I got a lot of stuff to do. I got stuff to pack. I haven't even packed yet and my flight is tonight and it's like already like gonna be evening. Anyway, I, I got a lot of t-shirts. Um, because I realize I don't have a lot of t-shirts. I, I like comfortable clothes. I tend to get a lot of tank tops and they tend to be kind of not appropriate for school because they're kind of like low, right? And plus I always wear cardigans over them anyway, so I was just like, I might as well wear a shirt. The first thing I got was this. It's kind of like an army green. It's like supposed to be folded la, and it's just, it's kind of like this. It's just, it's... <sighs> Yeah, yeah. It, it's just a normal boat neck, it's kind of high. The color's kind of pretty. I wore this on the last day back and I like it. Right, okay, I also got band tees. And I'm kind of scared that this doesn't say Joy Division or Unknown Pleasures in Japanese. Anyone who knows what this means, right, please tell me. I don't want to be wearing something that is like, destroy your love or something, like something ridiculous. I know that this is not like, a legit official Joy Division shirt but I really really like the print for Unknown Pledges. They didn't have it in English so I got it in Japanese which is a little bit step but it's cool. I also got this one from the same shop so this is how it looks. It's a little bit ratchet, I'm not gonna lie, okay? Normally I won't wear this out but for school maybe and I do actually listen to Sugar Ross it's an Icelandic band and they're pretty great, really, really. It goes around the back and it's just like a like a raw, treadless, like kind of really big tank top which I could also use as my pyjamas. So why the hell not, right? Right, okay, I got more banties because I'm crazy. <laughs> How could I not get Arctic Monkeys? Come on, guys. It's such a... It's so comfy, la. oh my gosh. Okay, it's 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 quite like fitting, la, but it's just a little bit big. I don't know what else to say. I just, I really like it. Because it's like, it's so comfy. And it's just kind of like the right oversized um, cut. 
and then I can fold the sleeves and just tuck it in and it's very effortless and I really like I really like Arctic Monkeys and I just want to like show everyone that I love it so it's it's great this is a little bit extreme I don't know whether because I don't really listen to Radiohead anymore but it's just it's such a it's such a nice oh I just I really like big shirts I really don't have an explanation for this other than I liked it at that time for now it's cool I might chop it up I don't know it's just, it's really comfortable lah. It's, I just needed big shirts, man. I also got a queen shirt, which I don't know if I'm gonna wear this. I don't know how ratchet it is, and I don't know how guyish it is, but I might, I might just go with it. Just, I'm still holding my boobs. I don't know, I just, I, mm, just good memories, man. Queen brings me back to like, upper sec days, when me and Sarah would sing on the corridor and piss the hell off everyone. Those were the good old days, man. <laughs> How many times was I... Okay, well, this... I kinda, you know, really, really like Arctic Monkeys and I kinda like the print. I'm gonna show you something else that's really retarded that I got. What? What? Brenda? What? Just... These are pants, okay? These are pants. Look at the fucking print, like... Huh? This is like denim, like... I'm, I'm not kidding. This is actual denim. And I thought it was- it came in a set and I bought the set for 600 baht. I bought it because I thought it was gonna be so funny. These make me look fine, but they're just- they're really thick, but they have pockets, which is like... <sighs> such a ridiculous purchase, but I-, I no regrets, man. I'm just gonna... Yeah, can I do this? Is it- is that okay? Because I just feel like I'm never ever gonna wear it, so I wanna wear it in something. Okay, I don't know. <laughs> stop, Brenda, stop. I got this set, which kind of makes me look like an SIA girl, but in like nightgown form. It's just a camisole, and then, um, shorts. I'm, I don't know, I kind of like the print. It's, it's this like, um, what the fuck is this? I, I think it's good quality, so, I mean for what it's worth, it was probably like 10 bucks or something. Nah. Um, uh, I got this, which is, which is so Abercrombie. I, f I feel la. Okay, anyone working at Abercrombie, please don't kill me. I just think it looks like it looks like something that y'all will sell. It's really pretty. Kind of look at the detail. It it shears out and then, yeah, I think it's really pretty. Reminds me of a tablecloth, but I'm gonna roll with it. Yeah, this was ten to fifteen bucks, which is really great. I think it's a good price. Mm. And then I also got this, which y'all may have seen because I wore it on one of the days. I think the fourth day I wore it. It's it's kind of, I got this at Platinum Mall. That one I got at Chatu Chuck. This one I got at Platinum Mall and it's it's another one of those like crochet detail things. And then there's fringe which I am contemplating to cut because this is kind of irritating. I got denim shorts too. The same exact cut. I just got them in a like a light blue wash and a dark blue wash. Have you seen me in light denim? Oh. Hello? Tapao. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay. Okay. I want chicken. I want chicken. I want chicken. Okay, bye bye. Bye 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 bye. <laughs> My daddy is so funny. My kid fell. Can you see the back? Yeah. Sorry for that awkward pause. <sighs> I don't know why I bought these. They look like every other pair I own, but I just like them. I like how like sim like like delicately curved they are, and I like how fitting they are, and it made my butt look really nice. It just is. It was nice. I I kept telling myself if I don't like it, if I don't wear it, I can sell it on Carousel. <sighs> I'm never gonna sell it. I'm just never. I. Don't... <laughs> And then I also got other shirts. I got this striped shirt. And I like that this is not like black and white. It's kind of like a neutral, like wheat color and black. I just come up with the worst descriptions. I'm so sorry. Anyone watching this? Um, yeah, anyway, I just kind of like it. I think it's, it's really soft. I think the thing about all the t-shirts that I bought was that they are really, really soft. I, I like it. It's good. Okay, I also got this. I don't know how I feel about this. I think it's quite avant-garde and I think it's quite cool. But then haul, it's like a bit big. It could be like a t-shirt dress. Ya feel? Ja feel? Ja totally feel. 
<laughs> yeah, it could work. I just, I don't know. I just, I just thought this was kind of cool. It's handmade, so someone deliberately spilled ink on this, which is something I appreciate. So I also got a duck printed shirt. No, it's not a duck. It's freaking bananas. I'm so into fruit, guys. Look, I thought that this would be a cute print. Don't judge me, guys. Can you imagine me wearing this with this? I, I can. I got a shirt which I kind of like. I've been wanting to get one of these like tie-dye shirts for a really long time because I think they just make me look so happy. This is like Darth Vader, right? So can you imagine if I wear this? I, I think it makes me look happier. Happy. Darth Vader. Happy. <laughs> I like the colors, but I don't like how artificial it looks. Like it's not really tie-dye. Okay, I also, I don't know when I'm ever gonna wear this, but all four of us got the same exact piece, which makes us kind of look like a princess, but I, I like it. Like, it's just a, like a flowy top dress kind of situation. It has really, really pretty embroidery, and you could wear shorts underneath, I guess, or you could not. I just, I haven't worn it yet, but I think it will make me look kind of demure. So, if I ever need to be demure, this is my demure clothing option. Sorted. This is just another one of those tank tops. I like the thin straps. I don't like it when they're too thick. I think the flutter is okay. If you eat a buffet, you need a cover up. Flutters do wonders. I'm a poet, guys. I also got this. Double strap. I don't know how to feel about that. It's kind of lightly knit. Can you see the knit? I don't know how else to say it lah. I don't know whether it's like hand sewn or what, but this one was expensive I think. And it's really thin as well, which makes me a little bit worried. I, I show too much, but I like it lah. Yeah, I, I also got a pair of pom-pom shorts. I don't know how I feel about the pom-pom, but I think it's a cute touch. And since it's trendy now, I. I guess I can get away with it, but when it's not, I'll just cut it off, I guess. I love how comfortable this is, and the lace detail. I got this at Chat to Chat. Oh, I smacked my face. Today's a weird day, guys. And then, I also got kimonos. These are the best finds. It's a kimono and short set, and they were selling for like 8 bucks a set, which means they're $4 a piece, which is crazy. Uh, yeah, I got this print which is kind of like navy with white scratches, <laughs> twigs, I don't know, okay? It's it's quite nice, ah, and it fits quite nicely. It's, it's a perfect, you know, length. And then the kimono, though, is so pretty. This was the last one, I think. Um, yeah, I just... Oh, look at that! Yeah, I look, this is another one of my, like, demure... Okay, don't mind my shots, okay? These are like home shots. I never thought that y'all would be able to see it, but okay. I think it's quite nice, leh, and I think it's a good cover up besides the normal knitted cardigans that I usually wear, which everyone is so sick of. Um, yeah, I also got this one in kind of like a reverse colour scheme. It's white with navy print, but this is much more delicate. I think this is really nice. This is one of my favourites. Um, yeah, and it has pockets as well. <sighs> Thank you for manufacturing pockets. Thank you. Like, oh, guys. And yeah, I, uh, pockets are so important. But the thing is, at the butt, it kind of looks like either the ends of my vertebrae or like the butthole. Which is so cross of me to say, but I say in an unashamed manner. Uh, yeah, and then I also got this kimono to go with, which I kind of like too. We are reaching the end, guys. We are reaching the end. Uh, yeah, so another one of the navy things that I bought was this romper. I'm not proud of the bag, guys. Look at the bag. Uh, the ruching is kind of horrible, but when worn, it looks really elegant and it, like, if you cover this part up, it actually could look quite classy. Uh, yeah, it's a creaseless material, kind of raincoatish. I like it. I like how short it is. I actually do. Because sometimes uh, rompers just drown me out and they kill me. Final thing that's also navy and white, uh, incidentally. You know, like the sports luxe trend going on. It's just really comfortable. That's why I got it. Kind of a cropped. And I use this word quite liberally because it's not actually cropped. It, it kind of stops where this one stops. It's very comfortable, it's very fitting, and the material is really good, like it's really nice. 
really substantial. I might actually wear this to Korea. I will, I probably will. And then I also got a matching pair of runner shorts, which I might just wear together. I think it looks really nice together. <gasps> it has pockets! What is this? Yuck! Perfect length, once again. The thing about Thailand is that they manufacture stuff for smaller people, um, shorter girls especially, so if you're short and you can't find stuff in western stalls, like if you can't find stuff in Cotton On or Forever 21, like you should really check out the stuff in Thailand. It's quite comforting to know that I can actually wear these to run even though I wouldn't suggest it. So this and this goes together. So yeah, that's all. Yeah, I just I just have a pile of clothes right now and I need to clear them up before I go. <laughs> Alright, so um thank you for watching and I will see you guys soon, I guess. Let me know if you guys like the the whole thing, because it's so new to me. But uh I enjoyed myself thoroughly doing this. Yeah, I'll see you guys soon. Bye!